there was an article that I was reading and I have always been taught that for maintaining that sugar balance, having the proper snacks, multiple small meals, like six meals a day. But this sure. article combated that and they were disputing that saying, no, I, three meals a day. So tell me your thoughts on that. Uh, it, what, well, well, it's really baby steps. If I'm taking a person from having extreme inflammatory foods and they're so accustomed to having 3,000, 4,000 calories of inflammatory foods per day, how do I get them to three meals a day? Then, it, then you perceive it as a diet. I want us to throw out the diet prison model. It's a dirty You're word. You're stuck on this like rigid path of I can't eat what I want. I have to be on this terrible meal plan. It's like torture, right? Right and you want to have foods that are satiating enough that you will eventually hit those three meals a day. But until we have your insulin levels balanced, until we get that beautiful um, pump working where you can rely on glucagon, the hormone that helps to burn your fat and turn it into fuel, until then, you may have that broken metabolism that requires you to have your blood sugar propped up with three meals and two snacks. And then once you become more and more into a healed space where you're on the anti-inflammatory plan for two or three months, then you're most likely going to be able to try on things like intermittent fasting, which is becoming extremely popular, where we put all your food into an eight-hour window, where we start eating around 10 and we finish eating at 6. And that allows us a good you know, 14 hours to balance your personal blood sugar, which is miraculous. If we have 14 to 16 hours to rest your metabolism, then you have high insulin sensitivity. Every single cell in your body can receive that glucose and push it into the cell effortlessly because your insulin receptors are turned on high. So yes, I want you to eventually be able to get to those three meals a day, but until you're ready, let's give you those two satiating snacks and let's really give you a satiating food. Let's give you enough deliciousness that you never feel like you're on a diet again. Let's just forget it. It's a dirty word. Let's let go of it.